Roach! Oh, why are you all the way back there, Roach? Free meat. Haha, <laughs> my aiming is not so good. Yeah, there's a little bit of, like, physics involved. Seems like I gotta think about how far ahead to shoot and all that stuff. And Dregas! See? What did I say? When you don't want to see them, you see them everywhere. It's ridiculous. Oh, there's a settlement here. Abandoned site. Whoa! Whoa, okay. That's... it's people. Whoa! Get him! Oh, Roach. Come on! He's ours! Don't let the arrows get you! Oh yes, it's called it's called Quen. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Pretty sure that guy just killed his friend. Ugh. Again. Oh my god. Can I can I make him kill his friend again? No. He's not good enough of a shot. Woo! Hang on, I'm coming. We gotta zigzag this. Do I still have that skill equipped? Kill him, strip him, then dump him in the ditch. The one where I can deflect an arrow. I'm not sure. Oh, it's another one of these settlement places. Now liberated. We did a good thing today. Level? Level? Can we... Can we do with that? Can we do the points? One point. Mm. Oh, we have a new slot now. Okay, that's good. I guess what we can do immediately is put this one here. 500 vitality. Why not? But what do we do with the point that we have here? Do we want to try going into alchemy? Oil, blade oil, potion overdose threshold. Hmm. If we're going to be using a lot of decoctions, I feel like alchemy might be something I want to dabble into. But just sort of looking at this, I don't know if I really... I don't feel invested in any of these. Like, time is slowed further for aiming bombs, whatever. That's whatever. Forget about this whole thing. Maybe I should look a little bit further ahead. Bombs! I just don't use them enough. Forget about bombs. Adrenaline points. Imbibing a potion. Oh. Toxicity costs. Um. Let's see how useful the decoctions actually are first, because that was my first time using one. It was really cool, but I don't know if it's going to be something that I keep using for a long time. Meanwhile, I could get Igni to 5 out of 5, or Quen. Quen is full already. Alternate sign mode. Oh. Okay, so the, the third row here has some alternate sign modes. Fire stream. Maybe I'll give this Igni one a try? Instead of just putting the point here, maybe we'll see what this is. Continuous stream of fire. Okay. To cast a sign in its alternative mode, hold one. Okay. If I have this, uh, I could just put it here. And I can't put, um, no, that's not, that's not unlocked yet. It's gonna be a while before we unlock our next slot. Um, usually when we use delusion, it's for the dialogue choices, right? So maybe it's better if I move it here. Yeah, because that would actually benefit from the sign intensity. Does that make sense? Can I try this out? Maybe somewhere where no one's looking at me, so no one gets mad. So that's Igni regularly. Oh! Okay. Kinda interesting. I wonder how the damage stacks up. Maybe right now, it just looks cool, but it's not great to use. Because it's only at level 1. Maybe I should look at that right now, just to make sure. Whoa, that is not the right screen. How did I do that? No.
Yeah, it doesn't really say exactly how much damage it deals right now, but... But, damage dealt by Igni permanently weakens enemy armor. It should be the same, right? Because, yeah, that's for Igni overall, and this is a type of Igni. I'll try to remember to try that out later on. Where does Joseph get all his food from? You know, we joined the barons, man. They will. He's a big lad. You guys are standing oh, over the dead bodies. Sorry. I'd rather starve to death. There's a merchant here. What? <laughs> Show me what you have in stock. Sell you some of my crap? The blue stuff? Yeah? I can't sell you bolts. Who the heck buys bolts? Seriously. So all that. We haven't really been feeling the pressure of money for a while now, so I don't think I really care too much. Even 3,000. Uh, I suspect some items will probably cost a lot. Yeah? And then we'll be poor again? But for now, we haven't really had to buy anything, so I think it's okay. It's okay. Do I want to keep the sword? The Forgotten Vran sword? Oh, kind of cool looking. Yeah, the lizard people. We haven't seen them again. Okay, well, I think that's it for now. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so long. Do you guys only have a normal merchant here? Whoa. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so long. Wanted to loot your stuff, that's all. <laughs> right after I sell stuff to the hey, shopkeeper. Oh, food! Hungry like a wolf, I am. I'm hungry like a wolf. Oh. Peasant. Oh. Wait, the Nilf Guardians are back here? Uh huh. Oh, okay. I thought this was gonna be a more neutral camp. But maybe if we look at the map? Is this more in the south? Yeah, sort of. So I guess, I don't know, something like at this point here, everything just becomes. Nilfgaardian-ish. Or maybe the Nilfgaardians just got here first. The Radianians lost out. Well, that's really cool and all, but I came here today because I wanted to get the Griffin Diagram. It won't be as cocky once the Baron's so if we can go get that, that would be pretty good. Uh, lots of things over there. Do I have to cross the water? Yes, I do. Or, I could wrap around. Yeah, we haven't been down there yet. Defender of the Faith. That's also something I want to do because it's level 10. But at the same time, we'd be going past all of these places we haven't been to before. Is that a good or a bad thing? I don't know. Well, let's focus on what's in front of us first. Um, I think I'm going to take Roach. Instead of swimming, let's wrap around. Come on. It's this way, right? I gotta wrap around... Uh, through the wreckage. Let's go. Sir, boy, we're up our noses and frights and horrors. Imps, some of them as mammals. I just liberated you guys. Stop whining. There's an actual road here. That's always good. Oh, look at the coastline. That's pretty. 7 p.m. I'm pretty sure I started out the day at like 5 a.m. But then when I liberated the place, ooh, it suddenly turned into evening time. Gonna kill you. Get oh, him. oh I want to try Igni, but I don't have... Hold up. Ow! That didn't work out so well because some guy got me in the meantime. Okay, we got to get the, the arrow guy. It's annoying. Now, this one just seems more useful because we don't have to aim as meticulously. So when we're in a pinch, it's the easier one to control. Pirate Leader's Notes Nothing quite like war. The Redanians and Nilfgaardians are at each other's throats, and no one pays a whit of attention to us. We can rob, raid, and kill till we get bored of it, which will never happen. Usually, I never set ashore near populated places, but this time, 
We had no choice. Our boat started taking on water after the last storm. We had to drag her onto dry land for some repairs. We were ready for a fight when we stepped onto the beach, but no one even tried to chase us off. Sometimes some of the Baron's blowhards come to us, but taking care of them's no trouble. Since we're not in any particular hurry, I've decided to build us a new vessel instead of patching up the old dinghy. Why not? Best take advantage of the turmoil while it lasts. I hear there's a boatyard nearby. That'll do just fine. And while we wait for a new ship, I'll send men out to look around for Queen Zuleika's famous treasure, which I got already. If it's worth a tenth of what I've heard, we'll all be rich. Well, I will at least. This guy won't even share with his friends. Wow. Okay. Enhanced racing saddle. Is that better than what I have? 45 stamina? Oh, it is. Okay, cool, I guess. Guess I'll use the swallow potion here. Oh, there's still more. There's still more people here. Gotta be careful then. What have you guys been waiting for? Let them burn a little bit. You guys are guarding the, um, the upgrade diagram, aren't you? Maybe not necessarily guarding it, but I know it's here. Oh, lots of good alcohol for me. Do you guys have food? I'm really low on that right now. Oh, I saw food. Chicken sandwich. The pirate leader's notes mention the shipyard nearby. I wonder if we can actually find that. Ooh, Master Armor's Repair Kit. Wow, they were they were having the life here. If only they had left a little bit sooner. Well, the diagram we're looking for is... It should be close by. Like right here? Yes! Beautiful. Oh, look at that moon! It's so big. Back in the day, this must have been a pretty castle. But no longer. It's been raided by bandits. Okay, well, that was really... Find the boots upgrade diagram using your Witcher senses. Not here, right? Elsewhere? Where? Like really, really far away? Here! Oh, that's quite far. That's okay. We'll leave that alone for now. Okay. Well, 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 well. Uh, let me just look at that. Oh, okay. We have something on the, the water right there. I guess I'll take a look at it and then we'll go back to the Baron. How about that? How do we want to go back to the Baron? Because I, I sort of want to finish this one up as well. But I know we're going to get so many distractions along the way just because all of this land here. I think we've only been through it because it was the cave, right? Um, It was something to do with Kira. She took me to the cave that was supposedly near Midcops. But Midcops is like all the way up here. And this cave is nowhere near it. Yeah. Well, it's okay. We're not really on a time schedule right now. So we'll just take our time and see what happens. Um, is it in the shore here, I think? Barrels. Smuggler's cash. Any fish? Ooh! Oh, okay, so you see the floating barrels, but they connect to the, the treasure below. Literally pirate's treasure. Don't really see anything super crazy just yet. Gnomish Gwynir. Ooh. Okay, that's that's cool. Is that the only thing here? I think so. Well. Alright. It's night time again, goddammit. We miss anything over here? I don't think so. So we can probably just get out of here now. Mm hmm. There's some 
fires over there. What's going on? Is it the abandoned site? It's right across from us. Oh, maybe it's the settlement, huh? No, the settlement's over here. What's that? Let's find out. By swimming? Are we gonna be okay? Try not to get near the drowners. Yeah, there's definitely something going on there. You know, that might actually mean there is some treasure there on the shore. Probably. But I want to check out what this is. Cannibal? Oh! Whoa! This is a different kind of bandit. They're fairly weak, though. Like, really weak. Cannibal Chief. Yes. Oh, this wasn't the building. They were... probably eating people. <laughs> I don't know what else they would be doing. They had a lot of money on them, though. Ooh! Got your treasure. This is what you get for eating people! No, this is what you get for making yourself so conspicuous. I wouldn't have come here if I didn't see you. But you... You guys set up a burning fire and everything. It was just really obvious that something's here. Ooh. Yeah, maybe that's like their thing. These signposts. Scary. How far do they go? I think if we go this way, it's gonna go back to that site. The new settlement. Ish. Ish. Uh, there seems to be a village right here. Okay, you know what? Let's try to make it over here. Let's try to make it over here. Fix that last shrine, and then we'll call it a night and get back to Crow's Perch. But before that, before going this way, there's a small village beyond this point, it seems. Abandoned? Occupied? Drowners? Oh. Oh, you know what? We gotta meditate. We don't have enough swallow potions. Let's make it daytime again. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god! Wait! There's more cannibals over there. Uh, forget the drowners for now. We gotta deal with this side first. Uh, I don't have high hopes for this town then. I think it's probably more cannibals. You can sort of see people standing there already. But I just want to see though, is it just drowners here or is there a marker? Just drowners? Oh man, we hardly uh, got to meditate. Stench. Oh! Ow! No, there really isn't too much here. I should have known, because the little cart over here by the mini cannibal camp, I was wondering why it was blocking the road. But it's more like an entrance, and now we've entered cannibal territory. That's what's happening. Oh? Hello? Rumble time! Stop walking into his door! They're fairly weak. So this is good. Oh. Oh. Poor lady. Well, we've rid this location of all the cannibals, but I don't know if people want to come back and live here. It's a lot of dead bodies. And not, you know, all from just being murdered. But some, there's probably some random body parts here. Half eaten or whatever. Ugh. I think I might have to meditate again. That might be for the best. Ugh. 
Is there something here? Smoking pipe. Stuff. The cannibal stuff, I guess. There's no way the, the peasants still live here. Ugh. Okay, how about for real this time? 5 a.m.? We good? Okay. Ho? Oh? What? Seriously? Where'd you even come from? Oh, there's more. There's way more where they came from. I can't get a single night of good rest here. I didn't get interrupted this time, but they're all over. I think there might be one more guy back here. That I saw earlier. Yeah, he's standing. Where is he standing? Uh, apparently there's a guy here, but I don't see him. Oh well. <laughs> okay, well it's a good thing that we walked past here, because now we have a new fast travel location. And we want to eventually make it down. That's really, really far down actually. Okay, well, we'll get there. We'll get there. It seems like there might have been um, a treasure that we previously found, but weren't strong enough to get by the shore. So maybe we can get that too this time. time. Oh, there's a lot of cannibals here. Winds howling. The further south we get, the more... I don't know, the more unorderly and uncivilized everything seems to be. More dead people. Come to the White Wolf! Oh, we're killing a lot of cannibals today! If we can rid the place of a cannibal population, it might not be a bad thing. I wonder if these people were originally cannibals though. Like before the war, when everything was still kind of okay-ish, maybe they were just normal people, but now that the war started, they don't have food anymore, and, you know, they're not about to let themselves starve. So maybe they were forced into doing this. Or am I being a little bit too generous with my thinking here? Maybe these are just bad people. Blood hasn't even dried. I think we might have stumbled upon a quest. More? Oh, uh, yeah, that's dead body parts and stuff in this guy here. Uh. Well, if we ever need to come back, we'll know where this is. There's a lot of them around here, though. A lot. Seriously. There's a little docking area, but do we need to take the boat right now? I don't think so. Nope. Okay, well in that case, let's let's keep going. Let me look at the map again. Mm-hmm. We kinda... Oh, there's another one. If we go this way. How many camps are there? Holy crap, all these bandits. Well, they can't go to a regular civilized city, so they gotta they gotta camp out here. Oh, this is the camp. Oh, but how come it's still being marked right now? Is it because I haven't found the main treasure chest yet? I think so. Here? Yeah, I think so. There we go. I don't think we got a sword that's better than what we have right now, but hey. Got a whole bunch of stuff. Gotta sell it to the next merchant, because I'm at 108 again. Holy crap. Whenever I start fighting and picking up stuff, then the weight, the weight goes really fast. Okay. Back on the main road. I'm pretty sure we'll get distracted sooner or later, again, but, um... 
Until that happens, we'll remain here. Hello? Another one! Just one? I'm just coming through here because I want to fix a shrine. There's cannibals everywhere, what the heck? Uh, it's getting darker. Okay, so this is the place where we found that lady originally, who wanted us to fix the shrines. Yeah, I remember. I remember. All we gotta do is keep going down the path. Getting a little bit swampy here again. Don't really like the swamps anymore. Not that I ever did. Let's get out of this place quickly. Wanna come by, Roach? I noticed that whenever we don't have full health, the, the health bar stays. Because just now we had a little bit of a sliver. Oh! Hey there. Is that a griffin? Do we need to fight it? Do I want to fight it? Slow now. Whoa. Heck yeah, heck yeah, let's fight it. Are we ready? We have three swallow potions. Okay, let's go, let's go. We're randomly fighting griffin things now. Maybe this will be like a trophy thing later on, but we just haven't found the person who will give us that contract yet. Ooh, I've never seen that symbol before. What is that on the minimap? Hey, you. Uh, aim a little bit higher, maybe? Nope, it's noticed me. Oh, okay, that's way- Goodbye, goodbye, we're done. It's level 25! I messed with the wrong griffin. Are we okay? No! Oh! No, 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 no. I gotta go. We're not meant to be here. Go, go! Faster. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, and I... Uh, I thought all griffins were the same. That it was just gonna be like the one that we saw in White Orchard, but no. We... we were not supposed to be there very clearly. My god, I was even trying to provoke it and stuff too. Yeah, okay, I'm I'm not gonna provoke you, but I do want the little marker, if you can give it to me. No? I don't know what that was, though. Was it like a nest marker, or...? I vaguely know where it is. It's okay, we don't need to touch it. <laughs> Let's just go. Let's go. I don't want to die again. Oh? Deserters? Strip him, then dump him in a ditch. Oh, you're fucked. Just two? Not a camp either. Just two random guys here. Definitely feels like once we've started going south, there's so much more lawlessness. Normally, there's a lot already, but here it's just entirely different. Oh? A locked chest. Probably for a quest, huh? Okay, well I'll remember. I'll remember for later on. What's going on here? Cannibals? Okay. Let me get at you. Ooh, you have a shield. Is this the... Um, the treasure that I was missing previously? Huh? Ooh! Missed at a really close range. No! Hey! This again. 
Oh my god, these guys are so annoying with their little shields and all. Come in here. Slow down. They can still block me pretty well, though. Oh my gosh. Oh, ha! They didn't block properly. Maybe a stream of Igni? Nope! Damn. Yeah, this guy is a little bit annoying, huh? Give up. Not good. No, we're okay. We're okay. I just have to be a little patient. There we go. Finally. Where's your treasure? Your hidden treasure. Oh. Marauder's notes. Common key. The key to the chest that we saw earlier, maybe? Last week, the three of us grabbed this traveler. Looked like the kind of cowardly fuck start shitting his breeches at the first sight of you. But seems looks can be deceiving. Bastard started waving a sword. Cut my ear off and sliced Olaf's arse so deep he's got an extra crack. <laughs> Except the new one's horizontal. Then he smacked Ivar in the forehead with the hilt. Poor Sod's still dizzy. We snuffed him in the end, of course. Every fellow's doomed when he's outnumbered. But it turned out he had a handful of coins in his pouch, a copper ring on his finger, and that's it. We lost out on that robbery. Paid more to the herbalist for patching up than we took from the horse on. So afterwards, Olaf said, Why the devil risk our necks waiting around for travelers when gold's literally sitting right under our feet, buried with the dead? A corpse can't defend itself, so the risk of injury is nil. No need to wait around all day till someone walks by. There's already a couple dozen someone's waiting for us, lying in their graves, each one marked out like veg at a grocer's. So I gave it a good think and concluded Olaf's talking sense. So starting tomorrow, we're going to stay off the roads and do our looting in the graveyard instead. Hmm. Seems a little bit unethical, but hey. If they're not killing people, if they're just finding treasures from people who are already dead, I don't think it's such a bad thing. At least they're not killing people. Okay, I have a feeling it's that chest that we came across earlier. Yeah, seems like it. It was right up on this little... little hilly area here. Yep. Ultimatum! Sounds cool. Ultimatum. I'm never gonna be able to find it. Oh, but it's, it's cool, but not really... Not really what we're looking for at this point. If we found it earlier, then maybe. But not this time, no. Okay. <sighs> There's also a town here with a different contract. Byways. Byways, okay. I really just want to get here. Just let me get over there, okay? <laughs> Roach, Roach, let's get going. Days a ticking. Cut through the grasses. If we can make it to byways, that would be good too, but it's not my main goal here. Oh, did I do this already? Seems like there's nothing here. Come on now. Oh yeah, this is the cave. It's the cave where we found the the elf and whatnot. Hey there. Uh huh. Okay. Well, that's cool, but not why we're here again. Ooh. Slow now. Whoa. Yeah, there's some stuff here, but I'm looking. I'm looking at the map again. What is that symbol? No griffins this time. It's. It seems like it might be underground. I wonder what that is. Can we find out from the legend? It's not in the legend. Oh. Oh, we can scroll on this thing. Oh, okay. Oh, that's that's how we find the blacksmith and armorer. But still, I have no idea what this this marker is. Okay, well, it's underground, not really near us. Forget it. 
Faster. Byways. The forests are really thick here. Oh, yeah, this town is not really... No. What is it? Ghouls. And where there's ghouls, there's usually corpses. We're not ready for this, I don't think. It's level 22. Uh, so it's nice that we got the fast travel point, but let's leave it alone for now. <laughs> I don't want a repeat of that griffin thing happening again. Getting close. How do we find that granny? Once we fix all the shrines. Whoa. What is this place? Guarded treasure. Wraith. Can we just forget about the wraith? Oh god! Ooh! Scary. Nope. Good thing there was just two. Looks like maybe there was an academy here? Or maybe a fancy house? Hmm. I don't think we really got anything useful. No. We got some alchemy pages. We've gotten quite a few so far. Can we make anything new? Bombs? Nope. Decoctions? Basilisk? We didn't make it earlier, right? No. Foglet. Night Wraith Decoction. Geralt's maximum vitality is increased with each foe killed. This increase lasts until he meditates or fast travels. Ooh. Could be interesting. Why not? Why not? Oils. Enhanced vampire oil. Okay, good. Good, good, good. But that's pretty much the only one we can make. White Rafford's Decoction. Immediately restores a portion of vitality. Oh, we need this. We need that, yeah. But we only have so many slots. We don't have that many quick slots. Which is a bit of a shame. Mm. I feel like that's definitely something that should be in a quick slot, though. Dang. Okay, well, uh... Very high toxicity. I'll put it here for now. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, there's just these staircase. Whoa! More wraiths? I'm leaving already. <laughs> Bye. I can't help but feel like we've wandered really, really far south. And I don't even know what's going on here anymore. Oh. You the ones destroying shrines all over Valen? What's that got to do with you? What's it got to do with you? We are the Heralds of Lightning. Heavy drops from leaden clouds. Unleashed, the Lightning's name shall be Overman. The locals claim the gods are unhappy. No fear of their wrath. The wrath of the gods? The gods are dead. We but dispose of their rotting remains, the dying embers of superstition that harms. Great. Need a favor, though. You gotta clean up after yourselves here. Then go back to wherever you came from, dispose of those embers there. Religion is the opiate of the masses. The gods are dead. Thus speaks Master Friedrich of Oxenfurt. Common folk fear religion and the priests, not the gods. And this fear enslaves us in fetters of ignorance. We must forge a new morality, or rid ourselves of morality altogether. You can believe whatever you want, but why would you destroy what other people believe in? You're not even teaching them anything, you're just destroying their stuff. No, we promised the granny. Amusing as this little show is, I'm getting bored. Leave, and don't come back. Or what? Or I'll tell on you to the headmistress. <laughs> Repression! Attack the system's lackey! Really? Displayed in the side show of a you guys are just students! Well, it could be quite profitable. Oh. 
Wait, my sword's not out. <laughs> Are we fist fighting today? Oh, okay, maybe we wanna... Wait, this is kind of difficult because... There's so many of them. We're getting outnumbered. Okay, you want a fist fight? I'll give you a fist fight. I'm still dying though. Yeah. Are you leaving? <laughs> I guess maybe Geralt doesn't want to um, be too tough on them. Oh, they're still dead. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't pull my sword out. Whatever. Are you guys actually dead or maybe just... I can't tell. Well, what really matters is that we've, uh, we've done the job, so it's all good. Oh, why is there suddenly a wraith here? Leaving? I'm just kind of left. Okay. No, they didn't get around to destroying this one yet. Oh. So we don't even have to report back to the granny? I think the quest just ended. Did it? It's a level 10 quest. Defender of Faith. Well, I guess that's that. We don't have to report back to the granny. And I wouldn't know where to find her anyway. I don't think she's at that same place anymore. Hmm. Oxenford Academy students. Uh, for my sanity, I'm just going to assume that they're not actually dead. <laughs> it's just that they're unconscious and we looted them. That's, that's what I'm gonna think. Something here? Yeah. Taking all their coin. I don't know, it's not like Geralt is religious, I don't think, but... Do you really have to force your beliefs on other people like that? If they want to worship a god, who are you to say they can't? And again, you're not teaching them anything, you're just destroying their stuff. That seems a bit... petty. Okay... Well, I came here to do this, and I'm done now. I want to go back to Byways, but I don't want to... Um, I want to fast travel. That's why I want to go back to Byways. Maybe we'll go to this town instead. Hope that there's a fast travel point there. Because I'm over encumbered right now. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Here we go, Roach. It always seems like it's a little bit more difficult to ride Roach when we're carrying too much stuff. This town is pretty close by. We shouldn't have too much trouble making it over there. Oh, it's... Slow now. It's abandoned. God damn it. Okay. In that case, is it all right that we fight like this? Oh, he's coming already. Can I meditate a little bit? Oh, surprisingly, yes. I just wanted to get back the um, swallow potions. Okay, <laughs> let's see if we can't just fight like this. The arrows are gonna be hard to avoid though. Ow. No. You'll regret your mom ever squirting you out. Yes, I know you will. I can't. Ah, yes, I still have that skill. One. They have a really big abandoned site here. What is this place? Fortimeria! More coming over. Oh! Very nice. Snuck up on me. Oh, you're fucked. <laughs> hey, kill your friend. Kill you. Oh, kill your friend. Uh-huh. Trying to get this guy first. Gonna kill you. Meyer landing. How long are you gonna make me wait? Oh. So this isn't one of those places where 
once we finish killing everybody, the population comes back. But it does seem a little bit special here. It's been abandoned for whatever reason. Maybe just because these bandits were invading. <laughs> Can I really, really slowly walk back and get the loot? Yup. Very slowly, but we're doing it. Okay. <laughs> oh, I was trying to see if we can, like, roll away, but no. Is there a fast travel point here? It's what I'm looking for. Hey. Oh, you're fucked. Why are you alone? Get him! <laughs> Come on! Ugh. Oh, it is one of those places. But it was just that one guy. Okay, well that's that's really good to see because that actually means hey. there should be a merchant around here. We're saved. We're saved. Uh. Playing with bows, little boy. Yeah, this is a nice place. I'm glad people came back. Okay, the merchant is right next to the I corpse. Ever have a son, I'll name him Geralt. Really? I don't even know you. Greetings. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. Here we go, here we go. Oh my god. I feel like at some point, maybe we should just stop picking this up. He's not gonna have enough money. Seriously. Even though I'm selling these for like one or two crowns. Oh my god! Is there no bulk selling option? Really? Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, is there anything I can buy off of you that would be useful to me? Just to give you a little bit of money? I'll buy your water. Yeah, at this point, I'm willing to buy water just so I can get rid of the, these weapons. That's a lot! Well, he's poor again. We're hanging in there, but we need someone a little bit richer. Maybe back at Oxenford. Oh, man. Okay, we're okay for now. Thank you. Farewell. Okay. That's great and all, but I'm wondering, do you guys have a fast travel point? Because that's sort of the reason why I came back here. Can try to win them all, but you won't. They don't! It's just a random sight, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, we gotta get back. If we go to Byways, I don't think we can do it because this contract is level 22, so those ghouls are probably really strong. Okay, you know what? Um, I'm gonna... My plan is... I'm gonna take a boat to Fike Isle, and then use the fast travel point there. How does that sound? I really need to get back to a freaking fast travel point. Or we could go this way. I guess. Yeah, this way would be okay too. I could ride Roach. Yeah, okay, let's try that. Let's try that. Roach? If only me man were forever getting tossed at the tavern. And this time, I'm not going to... Yeah. Let's try to minimize stopping along the way for random stuff. We can always come back later on, but right now, I really want to get back to Crow's Perch. Here we go. Oh! Hey, there's a lot of people praying here now. The day and the night. Best stay clear of the swamps. Oh. Remember when the Blackens overtook us on the high road? Uh, good thing we had the means to buy our freedom. And you'd not wanted to take Egypt Irene along. Said she weren't no use to us. Hmm. Might could fight for her soul. The day and the night. Doesn't seem like the granny's here, but okay, that's kind of cool. They're praying here. Back in Vizima in The Witcher 1, we had places like churches, but here, we haven't really seen anything like that. So I guess they just have to go out into the wild somewhere to pray. Let's get back to Crow's Perch finally, though.